I've been wanting to press this button for a long time, been waiting for Air Hauler 2. Uh, day's finally happened. Let's get stuck into it. Hi all, it's Shane here, Oz Flight Simmer. Yes, uh, Air Hauler 2 has uh, gone early access, so we can, uh, today's video we're going to take a look. Um, I've been wanting to, uh, been waiting to play this for a very, very long time, so uh, very excited. So I've downloaded it, we're going to jump in, but first um, I thought I'd uh, take the opportunity and just list off um, some of the features for Air Hauler 2. So um, if you haven't uh, played Air Hauler 1, if you uh, after something that sort of gives you a bit of... Uh, uh, option that you want to build your own airline or cargo airline or anything like this this is a program for you it really uh, it's a lot of fun um, and it has gone um, from what I've been reading on the website uh, it's taken a massive giant leap forward in um, previous version so uh, some of the key features um, and this is um, what I can see is from in-flight menu system um, You've got cargo jobs, uh, the difference thing about this time yet there's passenger operations so it's not all about uh, cargo. Uh, there's a new AI pilot skill tree system. Um, okay, take missions from clients at other airports. Uh, there's, uh, there's stock trading. You can upgrade your, your bases, uh, factories and production so you can build factories. See full, uh, not 100% sure what that does, but uh, obviously we'll find out. See full airport charts and air hauler to itself. Find aircraft parts from vendors. So I guess um, if you need to replace a part for a plane, you can do that. Uh, new type rating. So get qualified on aircraft before you fly them. That's interesting. Buy and fly aircraft in your personal fleet. Buy a new aircraft direct from manufacturer or buy second hand all new maps views and with great uh, circle routes okay so hopefully a better routing system create custom airports include database of common aircraft and early yeah so it sounds like a lot so um, we're going to go through and we're just going to have a look at the menu I'm going to set up a new company and um, and we'll find out what it's all about you can either import uh, your from previous air hauler one I'm just going to start fresh uh, delete company load previous company cancel quit or new so we're going to hit new and you can pick from what version so FSX FSX steam edition prepared one version two version three and company and pilot name so company name so we're going to use same as our YouTube channel so Oz pilot handle will be Oz So choose difficulty, so easy, which is $2 million, 60% so reputation, um, and a passenger configuration constellation. So this is obviously using um, some of the stuff um, that's obviously, it's using from the, the planes that I have installed in, in prepared. So I don't have a hell of a lot actually installed, obviously, because I've got a new PC coming away. So I'll put more than that. Uh, next one, $2 million, 60% reputation in the constellation. So obviously that's cargo version. Uh, medium is 1 million, 50% reputation in a King Air. Um, hard is 500 with 40% reputation and bonanza and 250 20% and it's an so if you've watched it by FS passenger videos um, we just got through the bonanza but we're gonna have to start again you can always sell it and buy something else anyway so I always like the hard stuff so I'm gonna hit career and hopefully I can transfer this to uh, the new uh, simulated PC that's coming we hit next choose um, a base, Pango, Pango, so I'm going to choose the airport there, so I've got the code which is NSTU, there we go, gives us the information. 
information about it. Which is sort of already new, so I'm going to select that there and you selected. So you can either just you can search it as well. And it gives me all the information. So longitude landing V618. Must be a different size aircraft. And the fuel runways 05 and so forth ILS frequencies and whatnot so yeah we're happy with this airport so we're going to choose it it's going to be our base to start off with and game options use no we don't use uh, weather generated um, no not yet don't need networking mode and we're going to ignore water and airports uh, uh, or water runways at this stage because I don't have an amphibious aircraft so I just hit next and complete it ready to go finish button and air hall is loading up for the first time it's creating new jobs so buy your first aircraft start new company in air hauler 2 and Osflame has a, I missed that one you have to do a type rating for this aircraft take the time for the type rating test so I'm not going to take it now we're just going to have a bit of a look around Click no. So I can see I can actually move things around it changes down the bottom right hand corner so I can log in to different menus from there. But if I go at the top here, so I've got job, job map, accepted jobs, routes, ad hoc flight, uh, different missions, radar, forms. So we're just gonna hit map. Yep, okay. So I can actually see there's my plane. It's really cool. You can just zoom in with the mouse. It shows where everything is. Yep. All the different places we can go to. Different. Shows me expired time, how much we make. Making a little bit of money there. Uh, passenger flights. Nothing there. But I do have 22 cargo flights. Stocks, so we can buy stocks there. Buy max, yep. No missions at this stage. Aircraft pilot. Aircraft at airport, pilots at airport, stock and cargo. Oh, yeah. Uh, this is uh, really, really cool. So, this has got obviously for the airports, it's got different. Um, Actually, pictures of the airport, everything that you need, all your frequencies and whatnot. Parts shop, okay. So we've got cargo and passenger routes. So we've changed company information. Let's see what that gives us. Bases, information aircraft base, aircraft at base, base details, base that's your stocks. Airport chart, okay. So all that information there, fleet. Cargo on board, so you can see a different fleet traveling around. Pilot and ops, Pilot log, assign, passenger set. It's just got so much information in, um, in air hauler too. Info, company info, so that's, that's obviously reputation and all that sort of stuff. Finances. I think that's so you can hop back into the office. We'll just go back to finances. Monthly overhead is 13,591. Factories in construction. So factories. This is going to be really cool to sort of trial all your different things. Stock and manufacturing. Manufacturing queue. So you guess, I guess you can make stuff. Add to ship stock. Yeah, I'm gonna have to read up a bit. Obviously, this is first impressions. I haven't read other than what's on the website. Um, items. So it actually tells you about all the different things. Construction. Construction queue. Buy an aircraft. Wow. It's just non-stop. Marketplace. All the different planes, crew, loans, banking, 
13% interest rate though, geez, that's low. Private sale. Complaints. Oh, cool. I'm going to pop that in there. Stock market. Portfolio. Obviously, there may be some bugs in this because it's early access, but I haven't seen anything. So all your different stock, management, this just goes on and on. Aircraft management, custom airports, import scenery. That's not there yet, I don't think so. I will see. And all your different options. Your mats and whatnot. Well, the office. So um, that's just a quick look at the, the menu, second hand aircraft one. It just keeps going on and on and on. So um, I think this is a bit of an all sort of one stop shop. So um, from the guys at um, Developing Air Hauler, thumbs up so far. It's looking very promising. So um, guys, you can uh, jump onto the Just Flight website and you can put, um, I'll leave a link at the Just Flight website below so you can take a look. Um, and. Uh, well, the next video we'll, we'll do the, uh, the the tight rating will be the next video. So uh, stay tuned soon. So hope you got a little bit out of that. But um, very excited, our hell has arrived. So talk to you soon, guys. Cheers.